Uh, seven, at 7 a.m. It was about zero last night, and the, the heat pumps did awesome. I, we didn't hear the oil come at all, on at all, <clears throat> waking up. But we put 18 inches of cellulose and air sealed the cap, so the upstairs held all the heat. So this is the Panasonic two-ton two unit. I think it's on, it's pretty quiet. Pumping out a lot of cold air, getting the hot air out of the cold air. It's about 20 degrees. So far, it's, it's amazing. I don't think we're gonna need to use too much oil. Uh, the floor may get a little cold because the oil Furnace is in the basement, which would keep the basement somewhat warm, but you can see my insulation video for what we've done in insulation. All right, I've had the air source heat pumps for about a week now. You can hear it behind me on, I think, fan speed two. It's taken me a long time to figure out how they really work well, because there seem to be about four or five degrees difference from what the remote says, so you set it at 60, then the middle of the house will be 64. I think it's because it's on a cold wall, probably where the thermostat is. And the install, it's been awesome. There's the one unit into the basement and around the basement up a wall. You can hardly hear the one upstairs, which has to be even lower because all the heat from the insulated cap it's upstairs starting at about eight feet down. It's amazing. So that's really quiet. Much better than oil, I have to say. The oil's good if I need to heat the whole house up quickly. The hardware seems to be great. The machine outside is very quiet. These make heat down to like, God, we were even getting heat some heat out of them when it was zero. We hadn't used oil hardly at all. And uh, no complaints about the hardware. I do have uh, one big complaint, the remote. The remote is like from something from 1980 before user experience was anything and before say the iPod came out. It is convoluted and poorly designed. There is something called Eco nav and air comfort trying to replicate a little bit of the nest I think because it has a motion sensor right there Eco nav Says it'll Notice sorry. I have a cold and talking slow notice movement bring it up four degrees if it doesn't see movement It'll go down four degrees air comfort is a two degree change um why aren't these two things up in this mode? I think they want to advertise them. The only problem is you can't tell if they're on or off without going like this, which turns them on, and that, which turns them off. Then you know they're off. So they should totally be up here. Also, there's no thermostat here telling you how warm it is where the remote is. That'd be interesting, wouldn't it? Um, I have been able, if I keep it on 60, on level 2 fan, to keep this part of the room around 64. And then the upstairs one is influenced by the downstairs one. In fact, when I first got this, I put it on auto. And I think what was happening is one might go turn the air conditioning on to try to cool it down to a certain temperature upstairs while the other one was fighting it downstairs. I'm not sure. This turns it on and off two or three times a day. Kind of useless. I want a programmable thermostat, which is like 20 bucks and lets me go, eight, say, 8 o'clock, 65 degrees by 9 a.m., 60 degrees Monday, Wednesday through Friday. They managed to do it with two buttons, maybe four buttons. And this is sort of some convoluted scheme down here with six buttons, and it's only on and off. So anyway, by keeping it on quiet, Fan level 2 or 1, as I said, 60 will keep it 64 during the day. So, no complaints on the hardware and the usability on the remote.
could have probably been done by a freshman in some modern design thinking course. All right, fine. So I tried the Eco Navi. Uh, that's cluttering up this terrible remote here. But it does work. When it doesn't sense motion, it drops four degrees. So I set it to 64, drops to 60. And I've kept the fan low here, so it's pretty quiet. So, so far, so good. I haven't compared with the Mitsubishi. Um, I bet they're... Hi, Ivy. I bet they're probably worth the, more, the money, but we didn't have more money, so I think this is bang for the buck. Uh, if you've had Mitsubishi uh, experience with their usability, especially the remotes um, and the noise levels, this is pretty quiet on a low fan. But anyway, post in the comments if you've been using uh, Mitsubishis. I'm going to go to bed now with my cobe. And this has been a great um, experience getting these air source heat pumps. All right, everybody. Stay warm out there.